the Echo Slam. Oh, there it is. Forward. There's your slam. There's the dunk. Hello. Gamer Nom is back. So for today's video, we're going to help this new second C using the slingshot. So guys, are you ready? I know that you've been requesting about this video. So before we start, I made a Twitter account for this channel for future announcements and giveaways. And also guys, you can show your support by using Star Code Gamer Nom when purchasing your Robux. Okay, so I think we're ready to start. But first things first, you can buy your slingshot at the middle now. So we are going back to the starting island. And we're gonna start with the bandits as usual. For the grinding, we're gonna defeat bandits one at a time. See that? Go in a higher ground, defeat it. To be honest, it is not hard to level up using slingshot. It's just that you need patience to do it. Okay, so you need to defeat five to finish one quest. And the goal here is to reach level 10. And after that, we are now ready to go to our next island, the jungle. So here we're gonna start with the monkeys. Same strategy guys, as long as you're in higher ground. To be honest, it doesn't need to be so high. I'm gonna show it to you. Just here guys, it's enough, okay? So you need to defeat six to finish one quest. Again, it is easy. By finishing two quests with the monkey, you will reach level 17. And now we are ready to defeat the gorillas. The gorillas, they're located here. There you go, guys. Same strategy. You see pillar one, go in a higher ground, defeat it. Okay, you need to defeat eight. There are four here, so it doesn't matter, to be honest, because you're gonna defeat it one at a time. There you go. With just one quest, you will reach level 20. When you reach that, you can start defeating the gorilla king. Again, same technique, high ground. See that? You cannot do anything about it. <laughs> Left click it until you defeat it. Okay, so guys, the goal in this island is to reach level 30. And by the way, we've unlocked our first skill, the sticky pellet, AOE. So faster leveling up, you can now start luring your enemies, okay? But again, it has a cooldown, so you will mostly rely on your left clicks. Okay, so again, the goal here is to reach level 30. And after that, we are off to our next island, and that island, oh, stat check, 10 melee defense, 70 gun. Next island, guys, to Pirate Village. So guys, we're gonna defeat pirates here. You need to defeat 8. There are 4 scattered in this area, so defeat 4 at a time. Go Z skill, left click, left click, left click. <laughs> guys, you really need to be patient here. Anyways, defeat 4. Do it twice, oops, to level up, okay? Okay. I hope everything's clear. The goal here is to reach level 40. And after that, we cannot proceed to our next mob, which is the Brute. So the Brutes are located here. Oh, you need to defeat 10, right? So you need to like lure 5 at a time to make things faster. There you go. Again, for those who don't know, Brutes are really tough. So you need to like defeat them, use your skills a lot. There you go. The goal here is to reach level 60, but at level 50, you can unlock your second and final skill, the explosive pellet. There you go. Not much damage, at least, right? We have two skills now that are AoE. There you go. So cool looking skill. Well, anyways, when you reach level 55, you can start defeating. There you go. Bobby the Clown. The mini boss in this island. Guys, just dodge that. So while moving, you can use your left click, which is really good for me. Using the slingshot, there you go. You can constantly damage your enemy. He won't be recovering his HP. Just dodge his skill and everything will be fine. Okay? Dodge. Oops, we got hit by that. Anyways, the goal in this island is to reach level 60. And when you reach that level, you can now proceed to your next island. Oops, that check. 20 mil defense, 143 gone. For our next island, we have the desert. Here, we're gonna start with the desert bandits. You need to defeat 8 like the pirates, remember? So just lure 4, go in a high ground, now you have 2 skills, and left clicks. So there you go. Again, is it hard? No. It's very easy, but you need to be patient. I hope that you have the patience, guys. But you don't need to do it. I already did it for you, you just need to watch. Okay, next up, Desert Officers at level 75. So they're located here. Just lure 4 at a time, same strategy, go in high ground, defeat them. Target number here is 6, you need to defeat 6 to finish 1 quest. Goal here is to reach level 105. And after that, before moving on to our next island, stat check, 46 melee defense, 
223 gun. Okay, so here we are now in the frozen village. Don't forget to buy the Gepo, the Buso, and the Soru. And after buying that, we are ready to grind. So guys, we're gonna start here with the Eddie. That's why we went here at level 105. There you go. Again, high ground. Just left click it, use your skills to defeat it easily. Okay, now we're gonna go back to the snow bandits. We need to defeat seven, right? So lure seven, oh sorry, five at a the time. There you go. Five, there are five scattered all around this area. Oh, look for a high ground and defeat the mobs. Okay, after that, defeat two more to finish one quest. The goal here is to reach level 130. Okay, so when you reach that, stat check first. 64 melee defense, 223 gun. Now we are moving on to our next island, the Marine Fortress. So guys, we're gonna start here with the Vice Admiral at level 130. Don't worry, he is very easy to defeat. Just attack him with your skill. Dodge to the side. Okay, there you go. After you dodge his slash, it's your time to use your own skills. But the good thing with this slingshot is that you can always use your left click to damage the Vice Admiral. Guys, we're gonna train here until we reach level 150. We're not gonna focus on the petty officers because I don't like that area to level up with. So next up, the Skylands. So here guys, we're gonna start with the Sky Bandits. The level requirement for these mobs is level 150. So they're located here. So you just need to lure four. One, two, three, and four. There you go, go in a high ground. And just like the other mobs, use your left click, your Z skill, and your X skill. Okay, the goal here is to reach level 175. So guys, again, if you're gonna ask me, this is a lot easier compared to control or even the gravity. No, no, the control fruit. This is easier compared to the control fruit. How about you guys? What do you think? By the way, next up, we have the Dark Masters. You need to defeat eight to finish one quest. Lure four at a time. There you go. Same with the other mobs. Very easy to defeat. And the goal here is to reach level 225. And when we reach that level, we are now ready to move on to our next island. But before that, again, stat check. 120 on both melee and defense, 435 in the gun. Okay, so moving on to our next island, we got the Coliseum. So here we're gonna start with the Toga Warriors. You need to defeat seven. You can lure four at a time and look for a high ground. So I chose this one here. You can just left click or use your skills to defeat them. So again, you need to defeat four, right? After that, just lure three or four if you want. More experience there you go the goal here is to reach level 275 and after that moving on to our next set of mobs the gladiators you need to defeat eight so you're gonna lure four one two three and four there you go defeat them after that one more set the goal here is to reach level 300, but guys, again, I almost forgot, at level 250, you can go here in the prison and defeat the mini bosses. We have the swan here, the chief warden, yes, and the warden. You can just server hop until you reach 300 here, or you can go back to the gladiators, and there you can reach level 300. There you go. Before we move on to the magma village, stat check again. So for the melee, 192 defense, 189, gun, 519. Okay, so here we are, Magma Village. We're gonna start and end with the military soldiers. Guys, we're just gonna focus here until we reach level 375. Lure 2, lure 3 here, lure all of them in the bridge. There you go, you can just stock them here. No need to dodge, etc. See these guys? They're not moving, they're trying to chase you, they're stocked. Okay, so we're again, we're gonna skip the military spies because they do blink, so it's really hard to like dodge them. And again, we have limited skills, so we're just gonna focus here. But to make things faster, you can start defeating the Magma Admiral at level 350. Every after skill, just dodge to the side. You need to dodge this skill. There you go. Use your skill, guys. Every time you're dodging, you can always use your left click to avoid the bosses from regenerating its HP, okay? I hope that's clear. There you go. Dodge. Use your attack. Go left clicks, skills, and that's enough. Stat check 264. Melee defense 597. Gun. Now we're moving on to our next island or city, the underwater city. 
just like the magma village we're gonna start and end with the fishman warrior you need to defeat eight guys this mob has a long range attack so almost dodge while fighting them so this is the hardest part i think <laughs> because it's tiring <laughs> okay so there you go the goal here is to reach level 450 but guys when you reach level 425 you can now start defeating the fishman lord that is the mini boss in this island there you go 4 million experience so here it is again guys same strategy left clicks left clicks to avoid the hp from coming back and every time you use that skill the trident you can use your skills after that okay dodge 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 left clicks wait for him to use the trident there you go and now is the time to use your own skills okay i hope that's clear every boss is easy to defeat as long as you're patient there you go again goal here is to reach level 450 and after that we are now going back to the skylands the upper yard okay here we are skylands let's climb this tree and jump 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 dash and solo there you go here we're gonna start with the god's guard so you can lure four at a time you need to defeat seven right so three or four it really depends to you there you go guys the enemies here are jumping so if you wanna like choose a higher ground make sure that it's high enough okay like this one so for our target level 525 yes but guys, if you want, you can start defeating the Whisper at level 500. You can just go in the upper yard and go back here. You can get the quest here in the quest giver. They also give the quest here again. There you go. Let's defeat the Whisper. How do you defeat them? Guys, just dodge his cannon and everything will be fine. So this cannon, there you go. So after that, attack him, use your skills. Do left clicks and after that, dodge to the side. Wait for him to use his cannon. There you go. And attack him okay again same strategy for almost all the mini bosses so here guys we're gonna skip the shandas and we're gonna go straight to the royal squads you can lure five at a time and check this out guys you're on top of a building just attacking them they cannot do anything grinding here is a lot easier comparing it to the royal guards because they have a long range attack so if it's fine with you we're gonna reach level 625 here but don't worry, when you reach 575, you can start defeating, yes, the Thunder God Enel. So you just need to dodge again his skill. Same with the other mobs. So here's the thing, guys. You can do server hop until you reach level 625 here. Or you can go back to the Royal Squads every time you defeat him. So just check him from time to time. I think the spawn time of this is every 30 minutes, I guess, or 15. I'm not sure. Correct me if I'm wrong with that. So again guys, the goal here is to reach level 625 and after that, you can now go to the final grinding island which is the Fountain City. So here guys, we have the Galley Pirates to start and end with. They have a long range attack so this is kind of hard to be honest but guys, you're almost there. Uh, 75 levels to go. Just lure them, use your skills. Lure them, use your skills. There you go. Don't worry, at level 675, you can start defeating the mini boss in this island, Cyborg. So by this time, I know you're kind of pro in defeating bosses, so I don't need to like give you a tip here. Just dodge, attack, dodge, attack. Just you always use your left clicks whenever your skill is in cooldown to avoid their HP from coming back. There you go. Okay, so once you finish this, you will unlock a quest that will ask you to go to the prison. Remember the prison where you fought with the wardens, swan, etc. We'll go back there, talk to the military detective. He will then give you a key, and you can use that key to open a door in the frozen village. Remember the cave? There you go. There's a door here. Use the key to open it, and you will fight the ice admiral. Okay? So, again, no problem with that. There you go. After that, you can go back to the prison, talk to the military detective. He'll then ask you to go to the military town and after that, look for the experienced captain and he will then send you to the second scene. So I think guys, that's it for this video. What do you want me to do next? Do you want me to level up a new fruit, continue some other fruits like the control, max level dragon, the doe, it really depends on you guys. So if you want something, recommendations, suggestions, just comment it in the comment section. So I think that's it for this video. Again, to all the viewers, subscribers, supporters, I appreciate you all. This is GamerNome, and GamerNome out.